Amen, amen. You understand this meaning, women? This means this is the bride and the groom. This is the promises to the tribes. And this is I am. A judgment against Parawa. Say Parawa. A judgment against Parawa. Who are they? You. Nations. Nations and nations and nations. France. Egypt, Britain, America is hell, Texas is saved, Jamaica is saved, Canada half half, Nation Israel, one fourth, one eighth. Azerbaijan, dead. Armenia, mines. Malaysia, hell. Indonesia, Casting the fires. Philippines. Flood. Women. The world has become really miserable in the eyes. I am not satisfied into everything that hath made to this earth. I become spirit, for your wickedness have increased in numbers. I have set my face as parawa. For you have prophecy against him. Who is this parawa? Israel. For it is not just a nation, but it's also a body that embodied Parawa. The great monster lying among your streams are your people. You within. It is you, the world, who are using witchcraft, sorcery, Muslim, Christians, you made it to yourselves. You have put on the hooks in your own jaws, G-E-W-S, and make the fish of your own stream stick to your scales. You are liars. This is what I say before if you have been led by this so-called prophetess pastors pastoras false prophets preachers calling themselves my messiahs dreams and visions they will they will uh, put Hooks, they have put hooks in their own jaws and make fish at their own streams. 
You know, men? They will be left in the desert. Is taking their is taking their asses into their own scales and be gathered down to the bottom pit where they will be will they, where they will be full full F E L L say F U L L where where they will be full of water like the dead cats under the seas. For they are the beasts of the earth and are not birds of the skies. They will be food to the mammals. Then all of you through this know that I am Jesus Christ. One God throughout incarnation. Pra me from pra. Osiris from the resurrected abode that have been taken to the heavens or I would say taken by the man who is the creator you know women women your body is a desolate wasteland when you preach the word of God you have been a staff of bread for the people. When you cannot grasp nor see my spirit in your hands, you splintered your own tore open their shoulders. When they leaned on you, that is, these humans, when they lean on you, you tore their shoulders apart. And broke their backs to reach. When they listen to your voice. When they, oh, hallelujah, I am, hallelujah. You, preaching the word of God. Talking about God. When you have no spirit. That can't think a deep within you. You don't think a deep within you. I am pleased with Zion. Hannah, you could deliver thyself for Zion who talks about my papa, who talks about my, you know, who talk about her gods. She does not blaspheme any. She does not give false hope to any. She does not say that, oh, they are uh, excited to to be dead, you know, like uh, this uh, this uh, women here talking about um, my bride of Christ, talking about my deaths. They are giving false hopes to their own, uh, those who listen to them, that I will come and then they will fly, fly soon. They will fly, fly soon in the middle of the seas. <laughs> You will be in that fly fly soon in the middle of the seas, women. You are excited to get out when there's nowhere to escape. You tell people peace when there is no peace. I knew what's gonna happen to my earth. I have asked women, just a sign of my hands, I knew what's gonna happen to the earth. Just a sign of my body language, I knew what I ask. For you are beasts that cannot see and cannot understand everything I do here. For you only hear a little, and then you're off. You do not listen to the here that I speak in. For your body and your mind is desolate, destruction, a wasteland, useless. Women, I am against your streams, and you are the land of Egypt, ruin and desolate waste from Migdol to Aswan as far as the border of Kush. It is you. You know? 
Your foot is neither a man nor a beast. Will never pass through it. It's like you, fly fly, raptor, <laughs> vulture. Come get them. No one will leave the here, women. No one will live there for 40 years in the vulture. You know the vulture, women? The fly fly, you are thinking you can escape to the rapture. <laughs> you will be devastated like an Egypt, desolate. You will be devastated like uh, the land of Egypt before time, desolate among devastated lands. Your cities is liar, desolate. 40 years among ruined cities. You, Andreas Hussein, you are desolate, liar, making your followers of false hopes and the other who talks about my death, who talks about the uh, Elohim Shamayim. I have an eye in each and every one of you who talks about my apostles, who talks about my father, bride of Christ. Talks about my matter. You are dispersed, worse than the Egyptians among the nations, and scatter them through the countries. That is what you do to those people you are uh, you are uh, sending your words to. Dispersing them among nations. Uh, they are because. Those who are listening to you, they are for nations and nations. They are dispersed from others, Egypt, other nations. They are scattered throughout countries. They are those you are conveying and reading words to when it is a sword. You are reading my book. Without my spirit, you kill them. You become we sardos. We sardos means hazardos. Hazardos means witches. Witches means sorcerers. Demons possessed. Who cleans when they cannot clean? Because every time you preach the word of God, it's just a bad energy to the earth that gives your own abode. Your own curse to your children's, your own sickness to your fathers, your own sickness of your holy, your own sickness of your souls, and your own sickness of the love of your bloodlines. It is you pushing them to hell while you are preserving yourselves. Because you think, if you talk about my father, you will be known. Are you hungry also for a fame? Like Tila Tikila? Are you also hungry? You could have been called my bride of Christ if you just... Shh. You are thinking of the worldly and not thinking deeper into things. Like deliver thyself of Zion is preaching to you. Like Adonai is giving you, feeding you. You know, women? Like how this, who listens to the word of my father here, that been here since the last few months since I was here. Uh, they are renewed spiritually. You know, women? While one is working to give good energy to the earth, Hataya. Missed you, Hataya. Darling. Ah, I miss you guys. Alba Archer, I cannot speak on to wash up because, um, uh, you know, my phone is uh, full off. So, anyway. This is about this, false prophets in here. They have hooks in their own jaws. 
calls themselves my brides. Look at them all fighting and uh, they have all the world. Bride of Christ, Bride of Christ, they use my names, Bride of Christ, death and hell, death and hell, death and hell. You know, they are, uh, they are what I see uh, before I come here, before I started preaching this, what I, uh, father asked me, I could uh, see this mosque with lots of uh, spirits or, or, you know, lots of spirits. They are gathered around us and they were, uh, they have their, uh, the time of my, uh, <laughs> the time of my, uh, um, uh, I'll stake those who are burning me alive is this false pastors. They have their own uh, long legs and they were doing this into the Solomon. So, you know, they're doing this. Women, Solomon's men's dead. You know, solo, alone, men. That's the symbol of me when I died on the cross. And that's the symbol of me when I died. In this end. You know, women? When I die in this end, women, untouched, solo, men. Meaning women, I was inside of the room on my own for three and a half days with none looking after me. Solomon. I am the moon which is alone, died alone. You get that, woman? So, that is the prophecy against Pharaoh. Pharaoh is this, you call prophets. You know, that is them. Of course, followed by the lowliest. Lowliest. This is what I've said before. At the end of 40 years, I will gather Egyptians from the nations where they were scattered. This is um, before I've come. You know? Uh, this is before I've come, women. Uh, this is before I incarnate in this flesh. This is what I, the Sovereign Lord says, At the end of 40 years, I will gather the Egyptians from the nations where they were scattered. This is the place where they were scattered, women. Where? Is spiritually, in the wilderness of this, you called YouTube. You know? I will bring them back from captivity and return them to offer Egypt, the land of their ancestry. There will be a lowly kingdom. It will be the lowest of the kingdoms and will never again exalt itself of the, above the other nations. I will make it so weak that it will never again rule over the nations. Egypt will no longer be a source of confidence for the people of Israel, but will be a reminder of their sin in turning to her, in turning to me, asking for help. You will know. It was I, women. I am 36 years old. I said I will come before. It was he. This one is I. At the end of 40 years, I will gather the Egyptians from the nations where they were scattered. Uh, this is where they were scattered, the sirens. You know? And they will be left. And that two meaning in there. There is two, uh, it is double of eight, uh, seven meanings in there. That two is the spirit. That two is the angels. That two is the fleshes. That two is the souls. That two is your ancestors. And that two is those who and have been preaching the word of God. You know? I am reminding you your sin every time I talk about you, false prophetess, false prophets, 
pastors, pastoras, preachers. You call yourselves my brides. Yet, you have not repent even to this very end. You just get worse. For filthy will carry on doing its filthiness. You understand, women? Filthy is carrying to be filthy. As your revelation says, I am revelation. I told you I am Babel. Babel also means Bible. I am B-I-B-L-E. Beble. Beble kal. Beble ya. Beble. A babe. So women, those who are profaning my name, it's you, Andre Susan. It's you, Tila Tikila. It's you, calling yourselves Bride of Christ. It's you, calling yourselves Prophetess. It's you, False Prophets. It's you, calling yourselves Apostles. It's you who talk naked without my Holy Spirit, you called confirmation. I am the goddess who comes down from heaven, lay down my life, for I can't take it back. For I am the spirit of my father, and the cycle of Maya, I am he, yin yang. I am she, young. I am him, nay. You call it nay? Bulhara hasa na hai hasa udahura he kan huna itik unan sahara to puro ula agonara amen. So, every time I speak, women, it's not just about me. For I did not come here to glorify my own, but to glorify my people, for my Father to glorify us. When I speak your name, I am asking you to listen and don't go against I, for I, the Lord I God, is telling you what wrong you are doing, the sin you are doing. And that is a sin. When you preach the word of God, talks about I. I know Zion knows I, for she have not denied me. She have not denied me and she have not and accepted, accepted my father through us. You know? So as to those who are here listening, they don't have to speak. We connect through our spirits. I told you, don't treat me like everyone else's. Just like them who knows and accept my Father. For I, the Lord thy God, are not going to ruin thyselves. For you have called me your Savior. But if... You don't listen without me telling you to do this, to do that. Or you call the information. You won't and will perish. For you are killing your own every time you give hopes to the people. You are what you are indeed. Giving false hopes to others. Every time you say, like yesterday I heard this woman. Oh, Jesus, oh, Dilara. If you were just in front of me, I would slap you with my left hand. For it is not. And I never hurt no one. But I will use my lowest spirit just to wake you up. Every time you profane my name. You know? You give false hopes to people. 
By saying you will be out of here soon, you'll fly, fly. Where? Vulture will take you out and push you all to the middle of the seas where you will be filled with water like a whale's full of water inside. Is that what you want? Women, I am not here to sway anyone for you have been swayed already. I am here to free the use just like how he freed you through my spirit in Moses. He is there. I am here. We are bridging. They are here. What else is, is down there? To bridge and free you all from that slavery you are on. Because you become slave of your books that you cannot understand. You don't think deep. You know, women, you don't think deep. That is self-righteousness, women. You call yourselves, uh, I told you, I knew my sheep. I'm not calling them my sheep. I'm calling them my brothers. I'm calling them. They're calling me sister. Women, I ain't here to be like anyone else's. Because if talking about etiquette or etiquette, whatever you say, A T I Q U E T T A, I have a lot of that. I speak the way I speak. For I am Tetragrammaton who have my truth. I am avoiding your lango. Because if I wanted to women, I can use my spirit of Americans or my Briton or my friends to speak your language. Which I can. But I don't use it. For it is cursed languages I've been throughout incarnations. To save my people that was and got the lost, been toast here and there and everywhere. For a spirit are born in spirit and flesh are born in flesh. They are toast and back. Every time you preach the word of God. You know? Like this, past O's. Like you talks about me without thinking deeper. Without thinking behind every words who is speaking. I am glorifying Hannah, deliver thyself a Zion. And through that is those who are listening and been with me till now. And those who is and will stay with me until they come. It is them I am glorifying. Those who will stay with me will surely save. But the rest who are still not here, they will be given their spirit through by my names throughout incarnations for them to be saved. Even so, the rest that I cannot find or see will be and will face before my papa as measurement of judgment I knew who you are that's when we will finish everything and those who will stay and stand with me until end of this until they come surely is my people I'm not just calling them my people it is him he's calling you people I am calling you my brides For they are coming. When I say they are coming, they have wrapped things up. There's still a little that we are finishing. Because what we are doing is spirit realms. We are catching. It's like uh, these uh, vultures here. 
uh, that uh, get very ishing about uh, the air fly fly soon. We are catching uh, them, all of them. So that when they come, because that is their uh, mark that they are receiving. Every time they preach the word of God, I told you, what comes out in your mouth is written into your body, for you are papers. You write your own. Or I, my spirit around you that can't see, writes it to you. Oh, women. How much you have ruined yourselves. I am glorifying those that have been listening to me without leaving. He's sticking together and giving their full trust to my Father. For it is not I you are seeing, but my Papa. You are giving the trust in those you cannot see, which spirits around me. You know, women, this is them. You are giving your full trust to. For I am humbling myself for my love for you not to perish. For my love for you to listen to these words of God. For my Father who sent us. When I say us, women, Adonai. For when I say women, us means... I am with my angels, my arts. So this is the judgment of para of pastors and prophetess. Death sentence. <laughs>